let's begin another main topic which is how to build the writing writing habit so within this main topic uh, uh, we've got like uh, subtopics which are how we can uh, build confidence and enthusiasm in our students especially in the classroom and of course there are different ways motivation um, you know giving positive and constructive feedback and then uh, bringing the element of instant writing at some stages of our lesson plans like giving them uh, writing tasks instantly without any preparation and another way is to giving them tasks and giving diet for those tasks by giving them necessary or required vocabulary or grammar and then we can introduce collaborative writing which is how students learn from their peers how they learn from each other how they work in groups in pairs and how as peers they read each other's work and assess each other's work and then writing to each other like emailing or um, writing on social issues or writing on uh, different uh, social issues or cultural issues and then how we can respond to students writing in terms of giving them feedback so these are the subtopics which we will cover in this um, main topic building the writing habit so writing habit uh, you know the background um, to this kind uh, kind of dilemma is that we've got a mixture of students uh, some are very keen and uh, you know desirous of writing and some are reluctant to writing so we need to capitalize on those students who are keen to towards writing who are quite uh, interested in writing and we can pair the less proficient uh, less motivated students with high motivated students so one of the reasons might be uh, as as language teachers we need to work it out like what what are the reasons why some of the students are less keen towards writing it might be because they have problems in spelling it might be because they are not able to write well formed sentences paragraphs and texts right so there can be a number of reasons so as language teacher we need to find out these reasons what are the reasons behind these insecurities and why the students why some of the students are unable to complete tasks of writing in the classroom what causes the writing block what causes confusion what causes procrastination or you know delay in writing so this these are there are different ways but as language teachers we need to figure out these uh, elements in writing so we need to understand the student's attitude for example we need to understand um, whether some of the students who are less prone towards writing whether they do the same in in their first language for example in our context if some students uh, are unable to produce coherent text in urdu they may have this uh, tendency even in second language which is english so uh, as as one of the common place experiences as being myself a language teacher is that we come to hear from our students that they have nothing to say that they are blank they don't know how to put their ideas into uh, well formed sentences well formed uh, paragraphs and text so we need to understand the student attitude and then make our teaching um, according to the needs of the student uh, you know there can be like pre writing exercises in the classroom instant writing in the classroom and choosing the tasks the right kind of tasks which appeal to the student which are attractive to the student which are of interest to the students and uh, these kind of appropriate tasks will allow students to say something um to write something and when we choose 
tasks we need to give necessary and required vocabulary about how they can form sentences well formed sentences and we can incorporate you know instant writing activities we can develop collaboration pair uh, good students with uh, with uh, less proficient students and we can also you know concentrate on giving regular constructive and positive feedback which stimulates the students to write more and which uh, encourages them and which uh, has positive influence on their self esteem and identity as writers 